YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. What's up, it's your boy Jarvis once again back with another video. Today is the first day of camp. Well, not really the first day, the second day. This is the first day of our tour day today, man. Today's Saturday, it's about what? 6.38 right now on Saturday. So we got two a day today, man. <sighs> but it's a blessing because we get to practice today, so that's the best thing, man. Most teams or most people can't practice today. So it's a blessing, man. So yeah, we got two a day today. And then we got a little team activity after practice, a little basketball game with the Hamburg Towers. So that's gonna be exciting. But yeah, man, hopefully. This two a day is good, it's fast, it's fun. Everyone comes out and competes and yeah man, but first we got breakfast at 7.30 and we gotta make sure no one is late. So yeah, we gotta get there early. And yeah man, I'm about to eat good. Most of the fields are soccer fields, so. Not really meant for football, you hear me? So, yeah, we practiced on this field yesterday. Let me tell y'all something. My ankles are done. You hear me? Done. All right, legit. D-O-N-E. Like, my ankles are cooked and baked. Hey, hey, whoa. Partner look. All free. She. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Siblings. 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 What's up? What's up? What's up? Team Germany, huh? Hello. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. The gang down pulled up. Barking. Send me in the morning. She's going. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Caleb still asleep. What's up, y'all? Oh, the members are here. The members are here. What's up? Yeah. Yeah. What's up? Yeah. 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 What's up, bro? Yeah, I'm great. Yeah. Bomba. Yeah. Yeah, what are you doing with the brush, bro? What are you doing? Yeah, got you. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Great. Right. You good? You up? <laughs> What's up, bro? Yeah. Yeah, bro. What's up, man? What's up, man? All is good. What, man? It's a long video. Hey, bro. Morgan, Morgan. Morgan, Morgan. What's up, bro? Yeah, guys. What's up, man? Morgan's in the kind of window, bro. Hello. They two? They two? Yeah. What, 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 what are we saying? You ask me a question? Oh my goodness. Day two, how are you feeling? Yeah. Great, great, great. Yeah. Tubinella. Day two. What's going on? How we doing? Um, my name is Tubinella. Um, I'm here for the reason. Oh, reason. What cool? What cool? Hey, make sure you guys check out my new album. <laughs> Caleb Mutz. All right, so we just got done with meetings. Now we're about to have practice, man. I'm gonna catch y'all after practice. Leave! I'm gonna catch y'all after practice, man. I ain't gonna lie, my ankles hurt. But we're gonna get it, man, let's go. Hey, welcome to camp, baby, we here. Welcome to camp, let's go. Hey, we're here for a reason, you know what I'm saying? We are the Hamburg Sea Devils. We have to remember who we are. We're the, one of the best teams in the league, man. So everybody be a dog today and let's go. Dogs on three thousand on me. One, two, three. Okay. 
Alright, y'all seen the video, y'all saw how it happened, but it's like once it happened, like I was in shock and like I honestly like start tearing up because I'm like, yo, my season is over before it even started. Like I'm like, dang, like it's it already, like this I'm done, it's over. But um yeah, and it's like hurting your finger on something you've done millions of times since you was a little kid catching punt returns is is wild and like our punter he's good and like sometimes he gets a hold of it and you have to run back and get to it and i guess i didn't get back far enough and i had to put my hands up to catch it up here and that jump yeah it hit my finger so yeah and one thing about europe was like when something like this happens you can get surgery like that day or the next day so i'm like bad all right i'm getting surgery and yeah, let's see what the process is, if I'm gonna stay here or not, or be sent home, you know, cause that's what happens, so you get hurt the next man up, so. I was just worried about what was gonna happen, so. All right, so it's not broken, it's just dislocated, yes. So as you can see here, that is not broken. It is not broken, so I was kind of happy that it was just dislocated. But the thing about it, I still had to get surgery because my bone came out, it was exposed, so they had to make sure all my nerves and stuff were good. And they had to basically open up my finger even more just to check to see if everything was straight. So that's the only part I was kind of upset about, but yeah, but if my bone didn't come out, I would have popped it in right there, but I bet, pop it in, let's go. You know what I'm saying, but. <laughs> all right, so the thing is, I didn't get surgery that night. I had to wait till the next morning to get surgery. So I didn't eat. So the last time I ate that day was 7.30 a.m. And you know, you're not supposed to eat on, uh, you're not supposed to get surgery on the full stomach. So I was like, right, but bet I'm not gonna eat. I'm just gonna wait. But more emergencies kept coming. I kept hearing the, he I kept hearing the helicopter kept coming in. I'm like, bruh, they're not gonna get to me. So that happened three times, the helicopter didn't come. So they came to my room at 12 a.m. that night. It was like, yeah, we're gonna have to do your surgery um, tomorrow. Do you want something to eat? I'm like, yes, I'm starving, I'm hungry, like, I need it. But the thing about <laughs> German hospitals was like, the food is not good. Like, I'm gonna show you what the food looks like. This is what I was eating on for the, what, next, what, four days? I spent, I was in the hospital for four, Four days and five nights, so five nights or four days, whatever. I don't know, but I was in the hospital for a long time, eating this every day, every meal, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, this is what I eat. <laughs> bro, thank you, bro, thank you. Look, look at this, bro. Look at that. Bro. Open that up and look at it, bro. Let's see, bro. Let's see what they're doing to my dog. <laughs> and I'm so thankful for my teammates, Javarian and Theo. They looked out for me and they brought me a McDonald's, man. Like, I think this was the third day they brought me McDonald's and I was about to eat what they brought me for lunch. And I'm like, yo, this is. I don't know if I can do this for any longer. If they didn't bring me this McDonald's, I probably was gonna go crazy up in there. Cause all I did was just stay in the hospital bed. I didn't move, didn't do anything, but sit there on my computer and on my phone. It was just a sad time, bro. It was not fun at all. <laughs> Well, the reason why they wanted to keep me overnight so I can get um, IV three times a day and my antibiotics three times a day, whatever, I don't know. But I had antibiotics early in the morning, prior to eight, uh, midday, around <clears throat> 12, 31, and then at night, <sighs> it was just stressful. Sometimes they'll forget that the IV is in there. So I would go to sleep at 10, 30, wake up around one, they'll come and take it out. I'm like, bruh. Just let me sleep with this going on. You already missed the time to take it out, but it's whatever, man. But 
as y'all can see, I got the antibiotics on and yeah. Yeah, but thankfully all in all, um, it was just a dislocation and I'll be back on the field soon. Um, and it's crazy. Some people knew about the injury and some people didn't. Surprisingly, some people in the league knew about the injury and they were like, man, what's gonna happen? Like, is he good? But whatever, it just happens. News travels fast around in Europe, so. <clears throat> But yeah, man, I just have to say, just do every play like it's your last play because you never know what could happen. It could be something routine as a punt return that you've been doing for years, routine as a catch, snapping the ball, you know, um, making a tackle, something you've been doing for years. It could be your last one, you never know. But thankfully, um, I'll be back on the field soon. And Things get money, you know, yeah, man. Back, you know what I'm saying? If you guys watch this video, thank you, I appreciate it, man. I love for you, feel me? It's gonna be more blocks soon. Uh, uh. Come with the money, yeah, they forgot to mention You get the money, now you got attention I want that water till a nigga drippin' I pray to God all my sins are forgiven Ooh, ooh, look at me now Things are looking up, remember oh, yeah, and I almost down. forgot, so I had the surgery or whatever, everything went well Um, But they put a pin in my finger I didn't know I had a pin in my finger until a week after surgery And it was like, yeah, we're gonna take the pin out and try to get you back on the field as fast as we can. So I'm like, wait, what? There's a pen on my finger? It was like, yeah, so they took the pen out, which took forever because she couldn't get the grip on that joint. So she was just yanking my finger, even though they numbed it. I really didn't feel it, but I just felt the pressure of her just yanking it and slipping on the pen like like metal on metal. That that sounds just that sound just hurts me. Like it hurts my teeth when metal clicks together. But I have the pen right here. I don't know if y'all can see it, but that's the pin in there. Wait, let me take it out for real so y'all really can see it. So this pin was in my pinky and it set in like, like this. So yeah, it set in like that. And yeah, and as you can see my finger is better because I'm recording this three weeks after. Yeah, they took the pen out, so all this good, all this cloud. So 